So for the past couple days, I've been playing Far Cry 3 on the PC, and I have been loving it. It's an amazingly pretty game with some really, really great story elements to it. But the one thing that's been ruining it for me has been the FPS troubles that I've been having. So I have two GTX 460s in SLI on my system, and I've been running into this bug where whenever I get into a gunfight or an animal pops along, uh, my FPS pretty much drops by half. Uh, but I think I've managed to find a fix for it. So if you're running an SLI setup uh, on your system at home, then hopefully this will help you. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Okay, let's take a look at a couple of examples of what I'm talking about. So watch the FPS counter in the top right. You can see that as soon as I come across this guy, the FPS just plummets. Uh, it goes to literally around half. It was hitting 50, 50 plus. I mean, it usually runs at about 60. Uh, but as soon as I see this guy, it drops down to about 30, and it's really, really irritating because pretty much every gunfight, this happens. Let's take a look at another example. In this clip, I'm deliberately assaulting this base as loudly as possible because uh, I just want the messiest gunfight to show you Seriously. guys the difference. So I'm running at just under 60 here, I run towards the base, and uh, as soon as I start engaging, you'll see this massive FPS drop, and it's just the bullets are flying and the system can't keep up. Now what's happening here is it's an SLI problem, so I think I have a fix for this. Real quick, let me just show you the settings that I'm using here. So against the options menu, go to video. Uh, resolution is 1920 by 1200. We're running full screen. V-Sync is off so that we can see the FPS properly. Uh, buffered frames is on one. I got widescreen letterbox on so that this is in the right aspect ratio for YouTube. Uh, we're on DirectX 11. Anti-aliasing is on two times. And we've got SS ambient occlusion on. So head over to video quality, and here I'm on a custom preset, uh, and you can see the top three are on high, post effects very high, geometry very high, vegetation very high, terrain is high, water is very high, and environment is on high. Okay. Okay, so I'm here at my desktop, and the first thing you want to do is go onto your internet browser of choice, and go ahead and download NVIDIA Inspector. Now I got this from techspot.com. I can put this link in the description if you want, and uh, yeah, it's only a tiny little, tiny little download, 228k. So go ahead and download that, and once you get it, extract it somewhere and open up the exe. Uh, what am I typing here? Uh, Inspector. That's it. <laughs> Inspector.exe. So once you run that, this this little window will pop up, and you want to head over to the driver version settings button and that will bring up this window. So at the moment you're looking at the base profile so you want to scroll down and find Far Cry 3 uh, F -F 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 -F. Far Cry 3, there we go okay now you'll see up here you've got SLI compatibility bits DX1X <laughs> so what you want to do is go ahead and click in this box and all you have to do is change this zero to a one. <laughs> That's literally it. So there we go. I'm gonna apply changes. So now it should read zero eight zero nine one two F five. And that's all you have to do. So after you've hit apply changes you can go ahead and close these and then fire Far Cry back up. So just testing out the game after the changes have been made and as you can see from this quick little engagement here no drop in FPS whatsoever, you know, it didn't lag, uh, there was no drop. And again, assaulting one of these bases, uh, try and keep it chaotic, uh, you know, there's still no drop in FPS. Uh, you know, before this would have been crawling along at maybe 25, 30 FPS, but right now, you know, I haven't seen it go below 55, which is good for me. So, um, you know, in my mind, uh, you know, my issue's been fixed. I can enjoy this game a lot more than I would have before. Uh, I did forget to mention that I'm on the NVIDIA 310.7 beta drivers. Uh, this issue may well be fixed by the next driver update, but until then, and in case it isn't, uh, hopefully this will work for you. So if it does, let me know in the comments section um, You know what kind of FPS you're getting now as opposed to before. And uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed the video guys.
catch you on the next one. So stupid! <laughs> <laughs> but I gotta say, I'm a little impressed with this one. Uh, but it's taken me a while to kind of get back into the swing of just how these card games work. And they're so damn fast.